going to show us a documentary uh, a film uh, they've been making about the Red Road Residents uh, Association. Yay. Ladies and gentlemen, good Alright, I'm busy for now. I'm only going to ask you a few questions. Before I ask them, can you introduce your names? Um, I'm Lily Rogers. Nice to meet you. I'm Matt Lewis. I'm, I'm uh, Richard O'Leary. Uh, Neil Donnelly. Alright, last night, as you might have probably heard, there has been a suicide last night of three innocent men. So, I'm going to ask you a few questions. You can ask the same questions. So, what is your, I'm starting with you, what's your relationship with? Um, well, I lived three doors down from them. I never really talked to them that much. I said hello every once in a while. They didn't seem to like me. I didn't talk too much. Yeah. Well, they, they were quite arrogant. I mean, they never looked me in the eye. As, I mean, we often passed in the corridor, so I was either just a few doors down from them. And I often wanted to say hello. I mean, mm. Just hurry you know. Sorry, I don't know anything. Yeah. Where, where are they from? Russia. Oh, Russia. Russia. So, um, I, I live next door to them. So, I live the closest to them. Um, they weren't out there, actually. Um, no. Very nice people. I'm just very good friends with them. Well, I'm sure you very much. So, I'm going to ask you, maybe, how long have you known them all? I've lived here quite a long time. Um, they moved in about about uh, six, six, seven months ago, and uh, they, um, there, there was a lot of noise coming from the flat when we were moving in. A lot of loud music, uh, um, Russian music, and I, I actually heard that that noise was the abuse that they were getting from being here because they were Russian. One night, I actually heard a rumor that somebody broke into their flat with a knife and threatened them to go back to their own country. Really? Well, yes. I mean, I, I think it's ideal to, you know, to the point, but I, I wouldn't go as far as, um, yeah, I, I think, I think if, if, I just think if they're that uncomfortable in this country, to, to drive them to the point of suicide, uh, why, why are they here in the first place? Well, I, I think it's people making them feel uncomfortable, really, if you're yeah. saying they're arrogant or spreading, spreading rumours. It's not very nice, they want to make friends and settle in. I move the point definitely. So any questions with you, Max? I just I'm just really confused about why they would commit suicide. I heard one of them was quite uh, sort of in the head, psychotic. Mm. Yeah, 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 you're the you are the it was um, the, uh, I think there were two of them. The, the, the one of them, the youngest, he was really just gone all the time. He was up he, I think he took um, heroin or something. But the, the other, the other one, the one was okay. He was, he was all right. The other one, I, I don't think anything, you know, wrong with him. But he was just such a nasty character. And, um, was he the? Uh, Is there nothing positive you can say? The one was, like I said, the one was okay. But you know, I mean, he's, he's well, a, well, what positivity have you felt with him? Like? Any positivity? Well, they were all nice people, really. You really got to them and so, so past the. The asylum seeker or the immigrants. Well, any negativity or well, the, the reason why you think they need to be suicidal? I just don't think they particularly like it here. I just, I just don't think they have to be very comfortable. Yeah, it's quite hard to leave the, leave the, leave the yes. three like cubes. I think they were uh, too young to be, you know, to be coping on their own outside. I think, I think so at such a young age, at any age, you should really stick to where you would start. Yeah. And uh, that's where you're going. Yeah. I have to go, I have to go to work. So. All right. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Woo! It's hard to put it.